This is Logitech MK250. It is a combo of wireless keyboard and a mouse. I bought this for a very cheap price. The mouse are in good condition, but the keyboard have uh, several issues. So, I'm going to fix this problem. Hi guys, my name is Alan and you're watching Alan Fista. The first issue with this keyboard is the keyboard are pressed randomly. Multiple keys are pressed even though I just press one key at a time. To fix this, firstly I need to unscrew the screws at the bottom of the keyboard. At first, I thought there are screws under this sticker, but it's not. There are two more screws under the keyboard leg. So this is the look in the inside of the keyboard. It have three layers of plastic, two are plastic circuit and insulation plastic in the middle. And this is the silicon membrane that connect those two circuits together when a key is pressed. There are two more screws and a metal bar that connect the circuit to the circuit board. So we need to take those two out. My attempt to fix this is by cleaning the circuit pin with isopropyl alcohol. Both plastic have the circuit pin, so you need to clean it both. Also, we need to clean the pin on this board too. You can see the cotton bud have become a little bit dirty. So now, let's test it again. Great! There are no more multiple button press, but spacebar number 9 and some other keys are not working. So here, I am inspect the board with multimeter in continuation mode. There is one pin are not having continuity to the chip. So I scrape away protective layer on the trace and test the continuity from the circuit to the chip. But there is no continuity from pin to the circuit. 
So what I've done is, I took one strand of copper wire and place it on top of the pin and the circuit trace that I scrapped the protective layer. As you can see here, I secure it with a clear tape, but make sure the tape are not blocking all over the pin. So here it is, the spacebar are now working, and escape F1, number 9, and all of the keys are working fine. Now the keyboard have been fixed, what I need to do next is to clean this mouse. As you can see, it has some red stain on it. I use isopropyl alcohol and a stain remover to clean this mouse. Now the mouse have clean and it looks like new. So there you have it, please subscribe, share and like this video and I will meet you again in the next video, bye bye.